How's it going, everybody? I'm the Poco Cavana, and today we're playing Death Road to Canada. A zombie survival game where you actually get to make... Okay, you don't have to, but you can make your own characters, and I decided... Boop! To put myself, my friends, and some of y'all in there, too. I thought that would be freaking awesome. The whole point of this? Escape the zombie apocalypse by going to Canada. Let's see. Ah. And one second. New game. And then choose a game slot. And be myself. I have a buddy. I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna bring Jovan with me. Because I play a lot of games with him. He seems trustworthy. And yeah, let's see. Familiar character mode. All the most circuits are now familiar characters instead of random. Yep, there we go. Okay. There we go, okay. So with this mode, it should just be the people that I made, which isn't a ton of people, but I can't imagine I'd be going far, and I just remembered, looking at this now, Jovan's a bandit. I'm not a bandit. I can't trust Jovan. I'm sorry. I have to, I have, I have to change. Um, let's see. I'll, I'll bring Matt with me. Matt is one of the people we do Twig episodes with. If you haven't seen them, we stream them on Tuesdays, and they are uploaded on Fridays. Well, let's get down to it. Poker Gavana hears rumors that Canada is a safe place, free from the threat of zombies, with nothing to gain from waiting around... Oh, from waiting around Florida. He decides to brave the death road and travel north. Dog barking, horns, gunshots, and other noises draw zombie attention. Hit the road, or read another hint. Nah, we got this. Oh shiz, how do you... I should have paid more attention to the tutorial. Let that be said. Uh, let's see. The group finds a rest spot. Rest stop along the road. It looks very quiet from the outside. Swarm size mild. Aggression calm. Current time morning. Nah, yeah, let's do this. Let's see, what do I have? Oh, I don't have any weapons. Alright, what's Matt got? Rebar? Alright, Matt's got a rebar. Goals. Follow, rest, lead. Morale is good. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We got this. Oh god. Don't 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 get me out here, man. Ah, Jesus. Ah. Okay, I forgot how to do this. Alright, Z is interact. X is how you And I oh shit, I gotta stop beating on my own car. I started out with, what was it, Kung Fu. For reasons. Alright, all right, I should stop. Alright, let's just go here, let's go. Oh god, this is more zombies than I thought there would be here. It said mild, didn't it? Ah, oh Jesus. Alright, alright, there, there's no point in fighting them, they don't drop anything. Alright, let's see. Oh, wait, what do we got here? Boop! Come on, match! Never mind. Let's go this way. Eh. Anything, anything, anything? Nothing. Also, if there's an item somewhere, it'll light up with, a, like, a small twinkle. Which helps out. Oh, there's a lot of good stuff in here, actually. We got, we got a rusty machete. Quick, Matt, pick it up! Pick up the machete! Don't get surrounded, though! Matt, pick up the goddamn rusty machete! You know, Seth would have picked up the machete. Alright, wait, wait, I can change who I am, can't I? Alright. I am not a ghost, I'm totally not possessing Matt. Who I think just picked up the machete. Oh, did I just pick up the machete? I think I just picked up the machete. Kung Fu, Kung Fu, Kung Fu. Nope! Matt's got the machete now. He just evidently doesn't want to use it. He's too cool for it. There's oh, shiz! Hit the wrong button again. Come on, let's get back on the road again. Alright, what have we got? Bullets? I literally thought that was a pack of cigarettes, not gonna lie. Alright, look at that, that's a good start. 
We got a bit of food, a bit of medical supplies. It's not great, it's not great, but it's something. Uh, let's see what else we can find here. I haven't been here, there. I haven't been here, there, yeah. I haven't been here yet. Those who also can't tell, I just woke up. Also, for anybody wondering why there's no face cam this time, uh, <laughs> between a mixture of me taking a shower recently, a bit of acne I may or may not have been attacking about as much as these zombies, you know, I may look a little bit like, uh, well, uh, I'll put up a picture, you know, like this. And, uh, ha 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 ha. Oh, dear lord. Alright, let's just get in the car. Like this. Go, 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 go. Wait, am I supposed to hold that button? Alright, so we got food, medical supplies, and a lot of pistol ammo. 40 zombies destroyed, and none of us have a pistol, so. That might not work out quite so well. But hey, we're still happy. It's nearly time to camp, but there's been a lot of signs of bandits today. Somebody needs to be awake in case of an attack. Who should stay up on watch? Ah! Matt and I both have an advantage here for, um, lack of sleep. Not like we didn't get any sleep, but we tend not to sleep a lot. If, yeah, yeah, that should make sense. Uh, Matt's been trying to get his sleeping schedule back though, so I'll take this burden. Poco Cavana stands guard for the night. He manages to stay awake, but feels pretty bad in the morning. Poco Cavana's morale decreases. Poco Cavana's loyalty revealed. Oh, cool! Yay! The group eats a decent meal minus four food. I am tired. I am something. It's a bunch of text. Matt really need to be careful with our shit. I was reading that. Poco Cavana is having a near crippling tooth pain. Is having near crippling tooth pain, without access to the precision tools needed. The only option is to pull the tooth out. He weighs the current options. <laughs> I saw it in a cartoon once. We got this. Poco Cavana, using old cartoon shows as inspiration, decides to tie his tooth to the car door. Unprepared for the sudden force of slamming the door, he is pulled towards the door and hits his head on the door. Poco Cavana is hurt. Poco Cavana's morale decreases. Poco Cavana's mechanical revealed. Wow, I am shit at cars, evidently. This is real life! Luck is on my side, says Matt. Douche. The group reaches the city as it starts to rain. The drizzle seems to rile up the local zombies. Swarm size, mild. Aggression, irritated. Current time, afternoon! When driving in the city, the group discovers... A hardware store and a gun shop. Oh, I can't choose not to do this. Fudge. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, uh, ah, uh, is it just the sound of the rain or is it like actually the rain hitting them? I feel like it's the sound of the rain because I would love to just go to the gun shop and be like, uh, Oh, wait, we have pistol bullets. Yeah, we got a lot of ammo, but we don't have anything to use it with. So if we go here... Alright, they're just a little more aggressive. We got this. Let's move it. Hiya! Hiya! I also, um... I think if you choose Kung Fu, I'm pretty sure you're not allowed to use guns. Yeah. Ha -cha. This is not a gun store. Hi, 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 hi. A mop. Oh my god, I'm sorry, Matt. I thought you were a zombie. Boop. Boop. I got a sandwich. Oh, Jesus. Actually, does the food icon sort of look like... Uh, I mean, I guess not like a Krabby Patty, but like the pretty patties. Oh, man, that was a nice chair, too. La, 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 la. There's no real winning here, is there? All right. What are you? That can of tuna had a burger in it. Fuck yeah. The apocalypse ain't so bad after all. I feel like I probably shouldn't ah, just be running at the zombies like I am during this part. 
At the same time, though, there doesn't seem to be much of a reason not to right now. As long as it's not like one metric shiz ton of them. Oh, Jesus. Or I miss like that because, you know, all I had to do was punch it, but I can't even do that right, evidently. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, get him, Matt. Get him. Get him. Gang violence. Where the fuck is the gun store? I've raided two houses, and I have yet to find a gun store. Maybe this is fine. Nope, you lied to me, Matt. Oh, wow, it was... became a... Hi! My name is Dylan. Uh, I'll be your massage therapist for today. Uh, you can just see all the tension just melt away. Yeah, your muscles just fully relax. Just, just die. We're actually serial killers, I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus, fudge, 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 biscuits! Shit! I listened to a death trap! Matt! Live! Be my legacy! Oh my god, do you not have any bullets? Oh my god, they're just feasting on my dead body. Oh, oh, that is... I mean, I guess that's for the best? Oh, right, you have a rusty machete. Ah! Uh. Ah! Ah! Shit! What about the gun? Ah! 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 Oh my god, this is terrible! Wait, what about the other gun? Hasta la vista! Shit! Ah! Ah! I need more ammo for this thing. Ah, oh, that is not the right kind of ammo. Ah! Ow, 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 wait, did I just pick up myself as food? Is that what I am now? No, 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 I want there to be more. Suck on this! Um, uh, shit, I don't have a one-liner. Fuck, um... Uh, screw it. Shit. Oh man, why am I even bothering with this? I'm already dead. No amount of vengeance is gonna bring me back. I'm sorry. Matt... I left you there. Wow, you fucking suck. I mean, you hit somebody, but you weren't even aiming at him. <coughs> oh god, evidently I'm dying. <clears throat> I didn't realize I was gonna die. But hey! We went from 9 to 11 food, we got more medical supplies, more pistol ammo, rifle ammo, shotgun ammo, and we killed 50 zombies! And one me. You lose 10 gas. Matt finds an empty spot along the road! That looks as good as any for camping. Matt eats a decent meal, minus 2 food. Do, 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 do. Music is fucking great in this game, by the way. We should have no problems getting to Canada! Who's this we we're talking about, you asshole? Matt meets a man trying to repair his broken car. He clearly has no idea what he's doing. Does Matt help him fix the car or recruit him? I don't know this man. Like, I'm pretty sure I didn't make this man. Unless they, like, randomly got a hat in their adventures, at which point I might have made this man. I need a second person. Matt accepts... Alyssa... to the team! Is that Alyssa? I'm gonna say Alyssa. Alyssa joins the team! Onward to Canada! How long did... Oh. I didn't even last 15 minutes. I freaking died. Maybe we should just ignore that I wasn't reading. Outside of Canada, most of society and civilization has been destroyed. You can still find people engaging in trade, with preserved food being the new currency. You have nine food left! The group runs into a trading camp. Eh, no reason not to go check it out. Oh, look, let's even brought a wrench. Cool. Bubba buns. Watch it, yeah. The group finds a twitchy man selling homemade bombs. No! 
Oh, Matt does not need bombs. A man selling anime and anime accessories from converted food truck. I am doing my part to keep civilization together. One anime sale at a time. It's like a convention. Four katanas, enough for the whole group. Lose five food. There we go, final anime. Matt spent all of the food on anime. What the fuck, Matt? The group finds a man near a rusty truck. The truck is full of gas tanks and oil rags. Both the man and the truck reek of gasoline. He offers to sell 10 units of gas in exchange for every food item he gets. No thanks. Can't really afford to, we have all these katanas. I really hope these katanas just break in one use. Well, let's toss one on, though. Alright, uh, let's, let's, no, 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 over, 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 to the other person, other person, other person. Do I have to click on the other person in order to try and give them this weapon? Trade the item! Trade it! How do I get over there? Can I use my mouse? Ah. This item, here, here, put it here. I'm gonna put this here, give it to them. This, there. Nah. Eh. What does this do? Can I not? Wow, that, that's... Yeah, most useful skill in the world. Alright, screw it, I'll just do it later. I'll do it later. Oh, whoops, I accidentally swapped who I am. Ah, fuck it, I'll be Alyssa. Get in the goddamn car. Throw the fucking money. And our food! It's all the same. Alright, 50 gas. 40 gas. Sometimes it seems worth to run sorry, worth it to run past a bunch of zombies, I'm guessing. Whoa, it's Roberto! It's nice to see a familiar face. He's being thrown out by his former group. They seem pretty angry. Roberto shrugs. Okay, let's recruit him. Roberto! The group accepts Roberto to the team! Wits revealed, attitude revealed, composure revealed, loyalty revealed, mechanical revealed, mechan- sorry, medical revealed. Actually, I think he's probably the best character we have right now. He's like super happy and I mean, he just got kicked out of his group, but he's like, yeah, fuck those losers. This city is covered with hordes of undead and wreckage that has been touched by a previous fire. The group gets surrounded, and their only way... Sorry, their only chance is sprinting through the sewers! We got this. Oh my god. I remember now. I gave Roberto... I, I Was it Roberto? No, I gave Kyle the most anime-like thing that I could. Ah. Oh, I really wish that was Roberto now. Alright. I'll talk to Katana. <laughs> Alright, everyone gets a Katana. You get a katana, you get a katana, you get a katana, everybody gets a katana! I still really hope these things just break in one use. Fucking hilarious. Alright, Matt, let's see if this will help us. Oh my god! Oh, 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 it fucking snapped! Oh my god, it really did. Do I have anything else? How the fuck? Is it just a chance? That snaps because these motherfuckers still have their katanas! I don't want a katana too! Wait. Oh my god. No, I don't have my inventory! I can't just get a katana! Oh, whoops, no, I don't want to leave the game. No, I, I want to stay in the game. Thank you. Ah! I'm so sad! My katana just broke in two hits, but theirs are just like... Yeah. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Since when does the MC have the character that breaks in, like, two hits? Ah. This is like finding the right sword in Kubo. For those who haven't seen that movie, watch that movie. Ha-ha! Matt, you seem to have been disarmed! Or disordered, I don't know. Roberto's the only one with a katana left right now. Oh, and I'm tired of shit. Alyssa, what the hell? Swing that wrench, girl. 
At the same time, though, evidently Matt is 100% of a better shot when I'm not the one shooting. Is that a chainsaw? Oh my god, that's a chainsaw. Is that... Oh, it's an AK. Alright, take it back. This was, this was fine. This is... How do I pick stuff up? Alright. We are ready for action. Oh, we have no ammo. There is no ammo for this. No ammo for this. Eh. I lied. There's ammo for this. And Roberto lost his weapon. No! But he has a rusty machete. It's all the same, evidently. Hell, the rusty machete is probably better than the katana. Boop. Oh my god, this thing is beautiful. Boop. Oh my god, unless you suck! Oh! Oh, Matt's got the chainsaw now. Holy shiz. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh my god. Uh, 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 uh. Guys, guys. Yeah, let's just... Let's back off a bit. Please respect my personal space! And I'm out of ammo. What have I got? Wrench, right? Ah! Ah! This is the wrench of destiny passed down throughout my family for generations! Ah! Alright, screw it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, 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 go. There's probably enough dead rings to run around at this point. Yeah, see you later. Oh shit, I was wrong! I was wrong. Oh god, he didn't get knocked over. Oh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ladder! Freedom! A freedom by any other name! Let's go! 81 zombies destroyed. Holy shiz. Wait, is that total? I don't think we killed 81 zombies there. We have a shit ton of gas, though. The group feels inspired after managing to survive that situation. They feel like they're getting the hang of this. Choose a reward for the group. Morale and a random skill gain. Shooting. Strength. Plus two fitness to Alyssa. Fuck you, Alyssa. I don't have you as a group member. That would normally come up, so there's no point to just give you fitness. I think. Uh, do 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 do. Roberto already has... The person with the worst morale, I think, was me. And I'm suffering of dead currently. So... Let's go with strength, since we're pro... Like, I ran out of rifle ammo. Well, Midnight. Oh my god, Matt has no strength either. At least Roberto has pretty decent strength. Now it is decent. Yeah! We all get buff as fuck! The group sets up camp outside a grocery store. They notice another group has been following them and will probably attempt to loot the place. Send in one person to loot. Send in Alyssa. I feel less bad if Alyssa just like sort of disappears. But Alyssa has no strength, actually. Oh, but hey, we got food. And then we ate all the food. And we still have no food, because Matt spent all the money on fucking katanas. I was planning on moving to Canada anyway. Matt makes mistakes while scouting a town, and gets cornered by a large group of zombies while unarmed. He is trapped in an alley. At the end of the alley is he heavy garbage and a large fence. Use parkour abilities or throw the garbage. Alright, Matt was not strong. So, let's try the parkour. Matt awkwardly tries to scale up a fence, but is way too out of shape to do so. The zombies attack! Matt is hurt! Matt's fitness is revealed. Terrible. Goddamn. Should've just thrown his favorite anime at him. Oh, cool. Roberto treats all the wounds. Haha, -ha, fuck yeah, Roberto. Thank you. MVP. The group finds an abandoned safe house. There's a little bit of ammo inside. Get pistol ammo. Get rifle ammo. On further searching, some unfinished pipe bombs are in the building. Someone must have had to leave in a hurry. Messing with them could be really dangerous. Roberto finish making them or leave them alone. I don't want to press my luck on that one. I'm just glad we didn't have to deal with fast zombies. You're fucking jinxing us. Whoa, it's Jovan! It's nice to see a familiar face. He pokes the dirt with a stick. Maybe he's drawing plans. Maybe just poking the dirt with a stick. Uh, I want a fourth person. No loyalty and no composure. Woo! Onward to Canada. I need to use the bathroom. Our car is about to fucking break. Roberto's morale decreases. No! The group spots a junkyard full of garbage and old wrecks. 
Zombies roam around the trash for reasons. You can't spot them from here. Ah, oh, near near near. Yeah, why not? We got this. And we have two katanas for some reason. What? I mean, heck, I'll take it. Here, Javon, have a katana. Roberto, have a katana. Matt, you're gonna be our gun guy, I guess, because you seem to be doing a lot better than I do. And are you using our fucking gasoline on this shit? No. No, 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 no. Alright, Roberto, you had a spare weapon, didn't you? Rusty machete? Yeah. What the shit, Matt? What the fuck? Alright. There we go. Alright. Yeah, okay, I think I think we're good. Oh, I can tell people to rest? Oh shit, why didn't I do that myself? Oh hey, you can actually have- Ah, player two! I should have either Matt or Jovan play this game with me sometime. Ah. Oh my god, I'm already basically out of breath. Alright, screw it, let's just go in here. Let's try and loot this- Please be a good dog. Please be a good dog. Wait, I think if I'm mad... Let me try this real quick. It's a vicious junkyard dog that wants nothing to do with you. This dog's personality probably wasn't great before the apocalypse either. It's too feral to even be swayed by food. Warning, we'll probably bite you. Use dog psychology. Make dog follow you. Leave dog alone for now. Dog psychology. Matt uses everything he knows about dog psychology on this vicious junkyard dog. It works! The dog wants to follow you. Have the dog follow. Colton starts following Matt. He could have been useful if you can get him out if you're alive, or a handy distraction if you can't. Yay, Colton! Let's swap back to Alyssa because God knows I'm gonna get myself killed! Holy shit, we got a dog! I kinda wish we got to name him, but Colton's fine! Come on, Colton! The rest of you can all die. Yeah! Oh my god, I suck at swinging. I swear to god, every time I swing at me, this guy's just like. Eh. Yeah! Ugh. Oh, oh, all together now. That was beautiful. Ugh. Go get him, guys! Okay, so if I just run them into the zombies, it seems to work a hundred times better. Just... Boop. <laughs> and why does this one have a gorilla mask? I did not think I was... Oh my god, I still have 12 days until I can get to Canada. That is so long. I still have... Boop! Oh my god. One punch. Alright, I guess it was one wrench. Eh, same concept. What am I supposed to be looting here, though? Jesus, Jesus. I need a little bit of load. Hello, what are you? Boop. Boop. Oh, boop. Guys, where are you going? Yeah, don't leave me, Colton. I love you, buddy. Oh my god. I... I need it! Oh, I don't have any ammo for it. Don't even care. I'm just gonna pistol whip people with it. Ugh. 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 This is almost useless. Holy shiz. Alright, you guys just take care of him. Just... Oh, I need to find some ammo for this. Oh, use his pistol ammo? Boop! I have no... I'm pretty sure my shooting skills are terrible, so... I gotta wait until I can literally just, like, press it up against their head, but... Boop! Out of ammo. Oh, that's beautiful! It just clink all the shots out. Alright, alright, alright. Aw, oh, shit, that's rifle ammo. Never thought I'd be saying... Oh, wait, I have a rifle. What am I doing? Boop! Actually, I should probably save this. Boop. Oh, it's adult. Can you get the rights for cults? We got adult. Can you not afford a cult? Buy adult! Adult. That sounds like I'm buying escort services. Never mind that, though. Why did you drop the rusty machete? 
What the hell did you pick up, Matt? Well, how do I get back down? All oh, right, it was this way. It was over here. The shiz. Wait, maybe I should get the rusty machine. No, I can barely even use the wrench. Yeah, I just run this train through here. Boop, boop, boop. To the car! This is going 100% better than I thought it would. Minus that little shaky start we had. Come on. Thank you. You know, this is a bit of a shaky part. Now, dying. But hey, we got to eat another day. Oh shit, do we? Colton catches up with the group to a safe spot. He seems he like he seems like he wants to stick around because reading is hard and I suck at it. Recruit Colton. The group is full. Who would you like to replace with Colton? Get rid of Alyssa. Guess we're the group to make room for Colton. Colton joins his team. Onward to Canada. Best choice ever. Being prepared is one of the most important parts of survival. The group finds a large campsite that is occupied by a few carloads of other survivors. Camping with the strangers is risky, but there's nowhere else to go. Oh, what? None are heading to Canada. Alright. Colton doesn't trust them. Jovan robs them and runs. Drive off with no sleep or camp with them. What the fuck, Jovan? <laughs> I don't think Colton trusts them. He's got doggy senses. Colton does not trust anyone in the camp. He stays up all night watching. Oh, okay, for signs of trouble. Alright. Aw, I'm sorry, Colton. But you saved us all! Alright, we'll let you get some rest next time, Colton. If we could get solar panels and a couple of batteries, it could come in handy. Let's keep our eyes open for something that I couldn't read. Whoa, it's Julian! It's nice to be see him. <laughs> I'm sorry, Julian. We have Colton. I know you'd love him. <laughs> shit. The car has completely run out of gas and... Ah, oh, shit. Oh, damn. Here we go. The group spots a bakery van that has broken down at the side of the road. The van is... Irreparable. The bread is moldy and inedible. But there are some good sugary cakes that are still good. Oh, some sugary cakes are still good. I hyped up the cakes, evidently. Walking. The group decides to set up camp for the night and try to eat a meal. The group is low on food and eats half as much. Alright, well at least we got some food though. Fuck off, it's better than nothing, alright? The group walking some... The group is walking through the court, the countryside, and stumbles on burnt out cars with zombies roaming around them. This is a good opportunity to check if one of the cars still works. Investigate. Ain't got no gas for that chainsaw now, bitch. Really dropped a machete for rebar? Wait, what? You're fucking kidding me. I'm doing it. I, I... Jovan, I'm actually gonna take this from you. You have a katana. You can shut up. There we go. Ah, oh, but I want Colton to rest. Fuck it, this is gonna be cool if it works. Yes! Oh my god, I'm mad! Oh my god, I'm mad. Oh my god, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Move, move, move. Go, go, go. I wanna be Colton. Shit, I didn't select him. Did Colton just break his weapon? Yes. Oh, Colton broke his fucking weapon. Oh my god, Colton is so fast though. Ah! Uh. Yeah. 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 There's the ice cream man. Can we just get on in it? Oh my god, I forgot to pick up that gas. Oh, I should have gone out. Shit. Oh fuck. We are not gonna last far long in this car. It's gonna go like two feet and then break down. Shit. Oh my god, it uses more gas than the last car too. Uh he has an lying on the ground outside of reach. Somebody steal this weapon. Jovan steal all of his supplies, let's do it. Fucking do it. Jovan steals the helpless man's snub nose revolver and then takes the rest of his supplies. 
None of us saw anything, alright? Chauvin, good job. Shh. No one saw shit. Car is out of gas. Fuck! At least we got three food. Alright, a few of us can eat. While walking, Roberto doesn't notice a hole in his backpack. By the time he realizes that there had been hole. Ah, there had been hours of opportunity for supplies to fall through. Medical supplies, pistol ammo, and food. Alright, that's not that bad. We didn't have enough food for anyone anyway. Fucking rifle ammo. Shit. Alright, we still got a decent amount of ammo, actually. We're good. After a long hike, the group finds a nice clearing to set up camp. The weather is nice, and the group is able to rest peacefully. The group didn't have nearly enough food to eat. Doubt festers. 